so hey guys welcome back once again and in this video i'm just gonna talk about one of the best model that is available right now in stable diffusion and that's protegen model first of all let me tell you Yesterday, I made a detailed video on comparison of result of different models. In that video, I also used Protogen model X3.4. So if you haven't watched that video, the link will be already in the description or you can click the i button. So the one thing that I was definitely clear about Protogen model was the level of detail that it was generating images. As you can see, each of the image that I generated yesterday for the video, I was literally shocked as the amount of detail was pretty amazing. As you can see, each of the image, none of the images were deformed, no eyes deformed, no no face deform, no lips deforms. It was pretty amazing and shocking for me. So in this video, I'm just gonna say about Protogen model and I was just exploring more about Protogen models. If you want to download Protogen model, it's easily available on Civit AI website. Just type Protogen and you can get a list of models that are available to download. It's easy to download and free to use. You just need to click on Protogen model and download model safe tensor from over here. So you can get this model easily on Civit AI website. So I was just experimenting with this model as you can see the amount of detail that is generated in this model. The results are quite amazing as you can clearly see over here. The next thing I was doing was that I just sent this image to like image to image and I was experimenting with the prompt. And now let me show you the amount of detail I got from this model. It was pretty amazing. So on the left you can see the image that I generated from using Protogen X 5.3 model. And on the right I was just experimenting it on image to image. So these are the image I just wanted to convert it into a crown, a queen. So I was just experimenting and just see the result that I got. So I was just adding pro crown on her head first of all. Just see the details okay. It was just pretty amazing. So these are the result that I got. I just got black crown over here. You can see black crown. The amount of detail as you can see on this okay so at the beginning I, st I started to get black crowns as you can see clearly the amount of detail as you can see first of all uh, the face the lightning oh my god it was pretty amazing so and then I just added like I just wanted a golden crown on her head not a black crown as you can see it was getting black crown so I just added like uh, it should be a golden crown queen crown so it started giving me golden green crown okay so it was pretty amazing see the level of details that I was getting okay and then I was just I just added like I just want emerald emerald style so this is the image that I got <laughs> using emerald style so it was just pretty amazing okay so this is the second image that I got using emerald style. So I was just experimenting with this image and I would just wanted to see the amount of details that this protogen model was generating. Now I, I will show you what I was using this prompt I was using to generate as you can see octane render of portal frame and draconian. I added golden queen crown and then in the end I was I just added green emerald. Okay, these are the images that I got as you can clearly see. Let me show you once again. These are the image that I got. Okay, so in this video, I just wanted to recommend this model and just try this as I'm going to definitely say that this is one of the best model right now that is available to like experimenting with. Okay, see the amount of detail. I was literally shocked. So that's it for today. I was just experimenting with Protogen model and just wanted to recommend you this model. Yeah, you can try this model and like it's pretty amazing. Okay, that's it for today. See you soon guys with more interesting videos tomorrow and more interesting models as well. See you soon guys. Bye guys. Love you all guys. Bye guys.